Hi Espers! For our announcements, I have been receiving comments na may kumuha ng Prestige Lulu sa may Coven's Moon spell but did not receive her Icon Plus Border. Unfortunately, I think Garena tweaked this event a day or two after it was released and right now, wala na nga siya sa client. Moving forward, if ever there are small changes like these ones or updates sa mga events natin, lalong-lalo na exploits, we will be utilizing TikTok for faster dissemination of info. I left my TikTok link down below. Fresh na fresh yan. So if there are any changes, I can utilize the pinned comment down below here on YouTube or TikTok to post short videos. Babala lang na hindi pa ako masyado marunong gumamit noon, but join me in my journey to learn more about the platform. Follow nyo na rin ako if may account kayo doon. Also, I know na may utang pa ako sa inyo na July Q&A. Don't worry, nakalista yan sa akin and baka isabay ko na lang sa September Q&A. Para the more, the merrier. Lastly, from weekly scrims, mukhang gagawin na natin siyang monthly and I'll start the registration form first week of September, so abangan nyo yan. Past weeks and days have been really busy, kaya bear with me. And with that out of the way, tara, oras na para manganib ang RP natin na naman. Meron na kagad unang bug. Stonks pa rin daw siya, pero Crime City Tours talaga to, Espers. But for today, we are going to have a new event and we need to discuss all of the mechanics first before diving into our board. Let's look at our price pool right here sa may redeem button. Doing it differently, I didn't re-roll yet for any of the Crime City skins. There are 5, so they are available in our shop already. And para naman hindi masayang yung participation ko sa event na to, I didn't re-roll nga. I'm not sure what's in the popular section, pero kasi empty siya sa akin. But we will check that out later in our Smurf account. Event duration nga pala is from today, August 27 hanggang September 2. As usual, 5 days yan. For our first mechanic, we are going to roll for a promo. Ito yung nakalagay na button right here. And we can land on any of these 6 options. If you manage to roll in any of these four promotions, yung green, yellow, blue, or purple coupon, you get 20% off on your roll cost when first entering the respective zone. Ano ba yung pinag-uusapan dito? Makikita nyo naman sa board natin that we have a green zone, yellow zone sa may taas, sa may right side meron tayong blue zone, and then on the bottom one, ayun yung purple zone. So our character's movement right here is in clockwise. So dadaan muna tayo sa green, yellow, Blue and then purple. For example, nakuha natin tong green coupon. 20% discounted nga yung magiging pinakaunang roll natin. Kasi we are starting right here sa my green area. Next thing that we can roll for, aside from coupon right here, is yung first play na 1 RP. This is what we are aiming for sana, pero we will try rolling for a promotion in our Smurf account also. So let's look at the odds. Lastly naman, kalungkutan, pighati, lumbay, walang kahit anong discount or 1 RP for our pulse. Pero baka maging iba yung perception ko, baka kasi mas maganda pala yung mga 20% coupon. So again, green coupon corresponds to this area, yellow coupon corresponds to this one, blue coupon here, and then purple coupon sa may baba. When you first enter that area, you will receive 20% discount. Pinakamainam na makuha natin is purple coupon if ever, kasi... Play cost differs per color zone. We're in purple, right here, is a danger zone because it costs a lot of RP when pulling in that area. Pag napunta yung character mo dun, 125 RP per play. And ayun nga, after rolling for a promotion, we can then choose to move forward by 1 to 5 spaces. Di ko sure kung random yan, pero let us see. Let us try it out na and see for ourselves. Thing is, I think Garena wants us more engaged in their event, katulad nung last time na Stonks, wherein you really have to play the event to get rewards. Rather than just straight up buying items, my entertainment factor. Pero let's roll for our promo right here. And ayun nga, first play natin costing 1 RP. Since we are in the green zone, we saved up 49 RP. Kasi nakita nyo naman dito, 50 RP per play. Tinan natin kung tama yung calculations ko. And ayun nga siya. 
since we have this coupon, we have 1 RP for our first roll. So this is in our Smurf account, Espress. So my Crime City na category included yung mga champions. Medyo mahal siya, I think. For the popular area, nandito yung mga pinakabagong skins. And the last skin line that we can find here is yung project. Even the champions are available here. Legendary naman, lahat ng legendary skins, I think. Even reaching dun sa pinakalas, which is yung Coven Evelyn. Included rin yung mga champions. So you might find gems right here that you want. Tama yung pricing nila kay Draven. Mas mababa. And then for our Hextech items, ayun nga. Hmm, hindi siya nagdo-load. Pero you saw that earlier already. And let's roll for our promo sa may Smurf account natin. And wow! First play 1 RP as well. Let's go back to our main account na. So tara, roll na natin to. Don't show again. Nakatipid nga ba talaga? I don't think so. And ang magiging option ngayon, forward 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then percent up for the jackpot. We can click on view here. And ang jackpot reward natin is 1,500 Crime City tokens. So what we are going to do here is get tokens and then redeem for rewards. Let's see kung may ikot natin yung board. Nakita na naman sa unang roll natin at 1 RP. <laughs> ang binigay naman sa atin is forward by 1. It's a joke. So let's go to our second poll. Seryoso ba to? Forward 1 na naman. Pero okay lang. Sige. Oh my goodness. <laughs> 1 na naman? Seryoso ba to? Para tayo makakuha ng reward dyan. Eh isang Crime City skin is 1,350. Sige. Pag yung susunod na may landmark, hindi sa atin binigay na forward 1, may pagkabudol to. Kasi when you get to the landmark right here, 150 tokens yan. Tinan natin ha, tinan mo, hindi na magiging forward 1 to. Since we are still on the green area, 50 pa rin yung RP cost. So let's go. O, tingnan mo. I-skipin niya yung 150. I-skipin niya yung landmark. Ah, joke lang. Lalagpasan mo pala siya. Okay, sorry. Nagalit ako agad. So whenever we pass a landmark, instant get na kagad yun. And ang total na tokens na makukuha natin from each of the landmarks, pag tinotal natin yung apat na yan, is 1,150. Ang mangyayari dito is you have to go for the full rotation para makaredeem sana ng isang epic skin for the Crime City skin line. Let's go to our next pool. 75 na siya since we are on the yellow area. <laughs> Forward one na naman. Sus! Mo, at this point, hindi na siya magpa-forward 1 pala kasi ang sunod natin is landmark. Oh my gosh. Why is this so rigged? 20 ang wala. We passed by the landmark, yung second one. So we got 250 crime tokens. And then tingnan natin, I think this is forward 1 again. <laughs> Tama nga. Oh my gosh. This is so rigged. What is happening is before the landmark, dito sa tile na to, we have to get here first. And what they are doing is, before getting there, your rolls are going to be forward 1 tile only. This time around, when we are here, hindi na siya magiging forward 1. So let's test our theory. 100 na siya since nasa blue zone na tayo. See? And I would be betting forward 1 na tatlo to para makapunta dito sa tile na to. Okay? Tinan natin ha. Since we are on the purple area, 1 to 5 purple. Ah, oh, nagiba. Pinagbigyan tayo dun ah. So let's pass by this landmark na. And we have 1 to 50 Crime City tokens already. Mm. Not bad, not bad. And looking at our history, we spent 876RP to get one epic skin. Meron pa tayong butal na tokens kasi for only 1,350 tokens, we can get any of these Crime City skins already. And currently, meron tayong 1,530. So let's click on redeem. And let's choose Crime City Nightmare Darius. Confirm. And confirm. So let's go for one more full rotation. And I'm eyeing kasi, this time around, tokens. 250 Coven tokens. So let's go. Para makakita tayo ng isa pang experience.
And then for our last draw, claim na natin yung dalawang milestone reward natin since we had two full revolutions. And maybe sa remaining days, we will complete these, itong five milestones, para naman makarami tayo ng pag-redeem ng Coven Tokens. Hindi pwede in bulk. Paulit-ulit natin itong gagawin. So now, meron na tayong 180 crime tokens. And the bad thing here, just like the stonks na event, wala tayong option to claim anything at a minuscule amount of tokens. Kasi imagine spending 125 to get this Hextech chest, may matitira pa tayong 55. Then, wala na. You can't claim anything after that. Sayang yung spinend yun na RP. But let's go now to our analysis section and see how much yung ginastos natin and what rewards we got. So for 1826 RPS spurs, we got itong bagong skin, Crime City Nightmare Darius, and then 1000 Coven tokens. If it would load correctly, ayan. 1880 na ang ating Coven tokens. And from our shop, claim na natin yung mga bagong items right here. So right now, ito na status ng COVID 2021 shop natin. Take note, hindi ako bumili ng Battle Pass kasi I don't think it's worth it. So I think I've completed almost everything right here. And without the Battle Pass nga, kaya na natin itong bilhin siguro 100 prestige points if we manage to get all of the milestones from the new event that we have now. Let's reroll for the new Crime City skins. Apat na lang yan. Then for our last reroll, ayun na nga, we got Zyra as well. Our final verdict for this event is a 6 out of 10. Medyo mataas, no? Pero ito yung rason ko. Number 1, meron tayong Crime City Top Up Promo na although ginawa nilang compact yun, factor to on the temptation na mag-spend kayo on this event. What do I mean by compact? This line right here, itong milestone bar, used to be longer than this. Even reaching up to 30,000 RP converted. Kaya naman when I spend 500 Garena shells with 2,700 RP value, we are expecting na andito na kagad tayo sa portion na to. Ayun nga, sinasabi ko. We are actually right here in this portion already. Unlike sa mga dating promotion nila. Still, if you can top up ng 1,000 pesos, yun yung pinakasulit syempre. Number 2, this is a great token farming event. Medyo nagre-regret ako na nag-claim ako ng Darius na skin. Sana tokens na lang. Kasi if you get all of the milestone rewards right here, sobrang dami nyo ng tokens na makukuha. And ang meaning rin nun, you've passed all the landmarks 5 times. So we are expecting around 4,500 to 8,000 Coven tokens if you choose to get all of the milestone rewards, plus kung swerte kayo. Yun lang naman ang considerations ko. Comment down below if I gave justice to the event. Again, 6 out of 10. Medyo nagsisisi tuloy ako na ginastasan ko na maigi yung stonks. But that's our event today, Crime City Tours. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Follow our gaming page as well on my Facebook. I'll see you on our next event, Espress, next week. And have a great weekend. Good luck sa grind.